Hello everyone, in this video we are going to start designing the first activities. So the first activity in our project will be the login activity. But before we start designing this activity, I have here two photos, one for user and another one for password. So I'm going to add these photos to the resources folder inside the drawable folder copy paste yes yeah, so I have added two photos one for the user logo and another one for the password now let's remove this text view let's go to the design I'm going to work in XML so the first thing I'm going to use the linear layout for all activities so here I'm going to convert this layout to linear instead of constraint layout. The second thing I'm going to add a background for this activity as hashtag 404040. Now after that let's go to the design and let's add to text. So go to text I'm going to add mobile and password so I will draw phone and also I'm going to add password for the login okay now go to text yeah also we have forget another thing which is the orientation so make the orientation as vertical to put the two plain text one after the other now let's remove the weight attribute for both edit text. So now I have two plain text. The first thing, let's convert the width of both of them to match parent. Second thing, let's add some hint. So here, for example, enter mobile number okay but uh, the color is black so i can change the text color okay to white and also the text hint color the text color hint also to white so as you have seen here enter mobile number also, I should add some ID here, but let's call this one login underscore mobile. Also, to add some photo to this edit text, you can use right here, where is right? Yeah, draw by right. Draw by right, I'm going to use drawable user. As you see here, it adds some uh, logo or some icon on the right of the edit text. And also, we can add some margin. So margin, let's say 20 dB. Yes, it is good. Now let's copy all this Okay, to the second one. Oh, I'm sorry, but this one is the password. No problem, no problem. Okay, and here also enter mobile. So let's change this one to text or sorry, phone. Yes, here for the ID, okay, I'm going to call this one login password, okay and remove this line and here also enter password and change the icon instead of user to password yes something like this so the user is going to enter the mobile number here and enter the password here so what about the login so after this i'm going to draw a text view here. So
So I'm going to use this text view instead of the login button. So I'm going to call it login underscore btn. Okay. Also for text color, I'm going to use the white one. Hashtag trouble F. Let's make text size something greater, something like 15 or 18. I think, I think 22 is better. Yeah, 22. 22. And for the text, I will write something like login. Also, for graffiti, make it center. Graffiti is something like alignment. Okay, so after this, I'm going to add some background. So let's add something like, um, what if we try something like this? Yeah, I think we can make it like this and here, for example. Yes, maybe this is good. Okay, and now let's add some margin. So, or yeah, some margin. So what about, for example, 50 or maybe 80? Yes, 80 dB, but it is, it should be from left and right margin. So what about left margin 80 and also right margin the same value or 80 db okay but here yes now to make it something like box so we can add also the padding so what about 20 db as padding or oh, it's bigger let's try 10 yes i think 10 is better Okay, so it depends on you. Now, this text view will be the login button. We can also copy this text view and paste it again here, but just change the ID so we can call it login sign up, and we are going to use this button if the user don't have any account so he call can click on sign up to go to the user registration activity and also we can add some margin here margin top let's say 20 db let's make it 30 yes okay so if the user enter the mobile number password then click on login if he doesn't have any user, he can click on the sign up so he can move to the another activity. So this is the login activity. Okay, in the next video, we are going to do the same thing with the registration activity. See you next video.